as you penetrate her, you ejaculate. Is this your situation? Are you worried about premature ejaculation? Do you want to last longer in bed? Then stay tuned. Hello, my name is Oge. I'm a registered nurse here in the UK. And on this channel, I talk about all things sexual and reproductive health, wellness, and occasionally impactful lifestyle videos. So in today's video, I'll be discussing 14 ways to last longer in bed. Number one, have a positive mindset towards sex. So if you have this mindset or you are worried or you have this performance anxiety or pressure and you keep telling yourself, oh, what if I come too soon? What if I ejaculate too soon? Most times you will ejaculate too soon because this is your mindset. So please have a positive mindset towards sex. So another way to last longer in bed is deep breathing. This helps you to relax. Most times the movies don't teach you romance, foreplay. Okay, if you want to last longer in bed with the movies, it's all fantasy. If you want to last longer in bed, deep breathe and prioritize your woman's satisfaction. Make it about her, not you. The third way to last longer in bed is to indulge in foreplay. You need to see my video on how to make your woman wet in order to understand this better. Seduce her with words and compliments. Think of what happens before, not the penetration itself. The fourth way to last longer in bed is by using the start, stop, squeeze technique. So when you are about to come, stop and squeeze the tip of the penis where the head meets the shaft. Now this forces blood back and reduces ejaculatory response. If this method is uncomfortable for you, for some men it's uncomfortable. If this method is uncomfortable for you, just use the start and stop no squeezing okay so with the start and stop what happens is that you stop trusting and come out of the vagina when you have the urge to ejaculate this helps to reduce the ejaculatory response and when the ejaculatory response is reduced you can go back and then start trusting the fifth way to last longer in bed is the use of condoms now condoms help to desensitize your penis a lot of times I hear men say, I want it skin to skin. Now with skin to skin, there is more sensation and you can come quicker when there is more sensation. So if you want to last longer, use condoms. There are thicker condoms, not the thin ones that gives you skin to skin vibes. Go for the thicker condoms. Now there are condoms that have numbing agents inside. It helps to numb your penis or desensitize your penis a little bit. Please consult your doctor or your healthcare provider before going for condoms with numbing agent. Now the sixth way to last longer in bed is through Kegel exercises. I've made mention of this in one of my videos. Now this is very important for both men and women. While I'm sitting here, I'm actually kegling. So what is kegel exercise? Now, when you have the urge to urinate, while you are holding the urine, probably you're not in the right place. So while you are holding the urine, just before you get to the toilet, you are activating a muzzle, and that is the muzzle you want to exercise when you are doing kegel. So another way to do this is when you go to the loo to urinate, while you're urinating, stop in between and continue. There are other forms of Kegel exercises. The, way, the seventh way to last longer in bed is to change or switch positions. Now, when you change positions in between sexual intercourse, it can help reduce sensation. Another thing, please avoid positions where your partner's legs, the woman's legs, are closed. So if your wife's or your woman's legs are closed, it can increase friction. And this friction can increase sensation. So please avoid the closed positions. So the eighth way to last longer in bed 
is through consistent sexual intercourse. Practice, they say, makes perfect. If you abstain from sex for too long, there can be build up of pressure and excitement, and this can make you ejaculate faster. So with consistent sexual intercourse, you are better at being a master, having control over your ejaculatory response, hence, you will last longer. So the ninth way to last longer in bed is through quitting smoking and reducing your alcohol consumption. Now, this is very important because it can help you improve your libido, boost your testosterone levels, and help you last longer in bed. Please see my video on 12 practical ways to cure weak erection and how to get pregnant with low sperm count. Now, the tenth way to last longer in bed is to eat healthy, exercise, and stay hydrated this is very important anything that is good for your body is good for your sexual health and function if you are not healthy your performance in the bedroom will be poor that is the truth so when you eat healthy you stay hydrated you exercise it can help improve your libido your erection your testosterone levels and can help you last longer in bed now, the 11th way to last longer in bed is to reduce stress. Now, stress can have a negative impact on your sexual performance. This is very important. Please reduce stress, emotional stress, any kind of stress. Stay away from toxic situations. This can help you last longer in bed. Another way to last longer in bed is by using desensitizing products. Now, there are certain products that can help you. You can actually use them few minutes before sex to reduce sensitivity on your penis they are generally called delay lubricant it has certain side effects like over desensitization skin irritation burning discomfort and some products can actually rub off on your partner it can desensitize her genitals which may delay orgasm for her that will be you doing double work as a man. But I've heard of some desensitizing products that will not affect your woman or your partner. Please see your doctor for recommendations. Also be mindful of using them excessively, okay? Using them in excess and their side effects. Be mindful of their side effects as well. The 13th way to last longer in bed is through medications. So certain medications can cause premature ejaculation. So please, if you are on any short-term or long-term medications for any reason and you are experiencing premature ejaculation, please go see your doctor with all your medications to review your medications. This is very important. And the last way to last longer in bed is to determine the cause of the premature ejaculation. So before you can say that a man has premature ejaculation, you need to consider different factors. Is the man the one complaining of premature ejaculation? Or is the woman the one complaining of premature ejaculation? Or are both parties complaining of premature ejaculation? So if ejaculation happens earlier than you and your partner want and is causing you worry, then you need to seek for treatment. In the course of the treatment, your doctor will determine the cause of the premature ejaculation. If the cause is medical conditions like diabetes, hypertension, you know, and all that problems, then you will need to be treated first. If the cause is psychological, maybe you have depression, anxiety, and other emotional disturbance, then you will benefit from counseling, psychotherapy, and sex therapy. If the cause has anything to do with your muscles, then you will need to see a pelvic floor physical therapist to help train the muscles that control ejaculation. If this premature ejaculation is persistent and is causing you worry, please see your doctor. See your doctor will help determine the cause of the premature ejaculation. Your doctor can also help provide treatment and solutions. I will see you in my next video.